Greetings softball fans and welcome to the Fireball Review channel. This is the vlogs of fire portion of the channel. I haven't done a vlog since way back in February when Shorty and I went to Disneyland together on my birthday. That was a very good day. I wish we could go to Disneyland right now. Unfortunately, we can't. But I think you and I, folks, we can agree that 2020 has been an absolutely miserable year for just about all of us. I mean, you got this illness going on, which is very scary. Uh, we can't see our family or our friends for the most part. We can't do the things we enjoy doing for the most part. The Los Angeles Dodgers have won the World Series, which is very scary for me. So 2020 has been a bad year, but not to worry. Halloween is here, and I've always wanted to do a behind-the-scenes vlog of the Halloween, the very prestigious uh, Halloween softball game that we do over on Dodger Films. Unfortunately, I will not be able to attend this this year's game. Uh, I am going to a, a World Championship equestrian event in Cairo, Egypt. I will be attending this virtually, of course. Um, plane tickets to Cairo are very pricey. But not to worry, I, I, I found a gentleman to take my place. He's going to vlog the whole thing. He's a very, I met him last year in Houston, Texas when I went to an Astros game. I went to two Astros games. I vlogged that. Uh, so go back and check that out if you haven't watched it. He, he's not in the vlog, but this gentleman is, a, he's a very eccentric fellow. He, he's an Astros fan, uh, an Astros super fan, and he goes by the name of Troy Landon. And we're going to talk to him here in a moment. Troy Landon, Fireball here. Thanks for filling in, buddy. My condolences on the Astros' defeat in the ALCS at the hands of the Tampa Bay Rays. But how you doing, buddy, other than that? Well, Fireball, it is good to hear from you again, buddy. But let me tell you something, son. Come hell or high water, we are going to get our revenge on the Tampa Bay Rays and their seven fans. That is a promise. The Houston Star will fly above anyone else next year in Major League Baseball. I can't wait for next year. I can't wait for this game. I'm leaving Houston first thing tomorrow morning. I, I already got my mask ready. I wear this mask because I got really bad hay fever and I got six ranches here in Houston, Texas. Uh, but I can't wait to get down there, buddy. Troy, 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 calm down, buddy. No more, no outbursts like that, okay? No outbursts when you come out here. Now, before you embark on this journey, though, I want to give you a little, little, little word of advice. I wouldn't wear that Astro gear out here uh, to LA, and 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 I wouldn't, I wouldn't be, I wouldn't show up to the Dodger Film softball game wearing all that Astro paraphernalia. It might be very hazardous to your health, my friend. I know you're a tough guy, but I just wouldn't do it. I, I would wear anything but that. Fireball, you got my words, gentlemen. I will not I will not wear my Astros gear. I promise. You got my words, gentlemen. As a Texas gentleman, I won't wear it. But I got to go now, buddy. I got to get rest up and get up early tomorrow morning to catch my flight to L.A. Well, th again, Troy, thank you for filling in. I know you're a major celebrity in the H greater Houston area. I really appreciate it. Please heed my warning, though. I'm telling you, don't wear that gear, buddy. But have a great game. How to do this, everybody? I'm legendary Astro super fan Troy Landon coming at you. I'm getting ready to head to the ball yard now. I'm very excited. Uh, had a good flight over here. Uh, I now I didn't heed every one of Fireball's recommendations. Okay, I didn't, but I didn't wear my Astros cowboy hat. I didn't wear my glasses. Didn't wear my Astros mask, but I did decide to wear my favorite Astros jersey, okay? Mr. Nolan Ryan gave me this jersey, okay, when I was just a little boy. It's one of my prized possessions, and I own four ranches throughout the state of Texas, okay? So this jersey means a hell of a lot to me, boy. But I also decided to wear my Astros super fan pants, okay? I love these pants. They're the most comfortable pants I've ever owned. But I'm getting ready to head to the ball yard now. It's going to be a very exciting time. I'm going to be pitching in this game. Before we stop at the ball yard, I'm going to get me a Texas double whopper. How do you do, son? Troy Landon from Texas. <laughs> I do not How like you. How you doing? It. What the hell are you supposed to be, son? <laughs> this is legendary Astro super fan Troy Landon. I'm here with Forrest Gump. And who the hell are you supposed to be, son? I'm Boba Shit. We play together in the American right. Boba Shit? I thought he was a Star Wars character. <laughs> you play for the Blue Jays? Yeah, that's right. That blew my mind, ladies and gentlemen. 
Mr. Bobby, is that you? I watch your videos all the time. My name's Troy Land, and I'm Astro Super Fan. Oh my gosh, Astro Super Fan, Troy? Troy Landon, that's right. Troy Landon, uh, yeah. great to meet you, Troy. Good now, to see uh, you, son. Do you think the Astros cheated? Oh, no, son, come on. No, we didn't cheat, we just bend the rules a little bit. Everybody <laughs> bends the rules a little bit. And Troy Landon knows all about cheating. I've had six successful marriages in my life. Oh my God, ladies and gentlemen, I've died and gone to heaven. It's Jesus Christ. I'm sweet Jesus. And you are unforgiven, sir. Unbelievable, son. Unforgiven. I thought I thought everyone was forgiven. No, everybody except the Astros. Oh, Troy Land back with you. Son, who are you supposed to be now? I'm among us, look. You look like a giant banana. I'm, I'm visiting here from Texas. Oh my God, I just saw Jesus now. This is the devil. <laughs> who are you? Are you are you the devil, son? Look at this costume. Troy Land back with you. Look at look at who I've run into right here. I knew once I come to California there would be a giant freak show. Son, what are you supposed to be? Call me a freak? You are a giant freak, son. I'm a giant purple freak. Purple? I'm the joker. You you look like you look like one of those boys at the, the rodeo that follow around the bulls. I ain't no rodeo clown. Oh. You're the clown. Look at the team you're rooting for. <laughs> Son, what are you supposed to be? That is a lot of hair, son. What, what's going on? Wait, 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 what happened? What happened to the rest of this man's body? Miss? <laughs> oh my God, oh my God, I'm dying. Shut look at Mr. Hulk Hogan is here, ladies and gentlemen. I, I've always wanted to ask you a question, sir. Is wrestling, is it, is it, it's real, right? Oh yeah, it's real. Absolutely real, I knew it. Troy Landon here through the magic of editing. I'm going to narrate my own at bat. Let me tell you something, ladies and gentlemen. That man with the toilet behind me, he was saying some nasty things to Troy Landon. Okay, here's the pitch. I'm going to get jammed just a little bit. And that's a high pop-up. That ball was hit so high, it hit two sparrows and a drone on the way down. Never mind that man address. That's just California for you. There's the other toilet man. He's going to be safe at third base. And there's Troy Landon standing majestically. Jesus H. Christ, can you help this man down here? He's got no legs. Look at this oh. guy. Help him, Jesus. Heal him. My life is a lie. Son, did you see that masterpiece I just pitched for Team Benny? That, I was, that was beautiful. <laughs> I, look, I look like Justin Verlander, except my, my ex-wives are all much better looking than his wife. Let me tell you something. You are one lucky man. <laughs>